Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Some Eco. So today I think we're going to make that machinist table. I finally built our new little uh, room here, or a little new uh, building. I guess it's a building technically, connected to the main building. But uh, I found a lot of clay, so I was digging clay into here. And then uh, I've been digging all this clay. I might as well dig it. I just thought, because they keep going far away and there's quite a bit here. So uh, I've been working on that. That's why there's a mess. Oh gosh. Okay, I think we have to go this way. There we go. <laughs> uh, anyways, and then I'll just clean it up. Uh, I'm going to widen this road, uh, ch change it to this one, and then make it too wide. Probably get it uh, ramped up here, and then eventually I, I'll probably go further there. But, you know, it depends on other people as well, right? But uh, I do want to change it up eventually because we do want a larger and bigger road. Uh, apparently for later games so I'm kind of just working on the basics even if it's not across the world right so here is our stockpiles beautiful we got our two on the top we have more than enough room for another stockpile uh, up here obviously I'm not interested in doing that quite yet because we got enough room on these but yeah we got lots of room up here now to definitely fit in that second stockpile uh, which is awesome so uh, two of them actually so more than enough for now and then inside this is what it looks like so um obviously i'm digging underground and it's this here. that's funny it happens something goes crazy with the physics or something it probably was when i was clearing out this area because this is over top of the river by the way which you wouldn't really notice anymore because it's all here but i didn't ruin the river in a sense it's just on top of the river so these guys are full of fish by the way i haven't been touching this often mm, don't don't tell on me. Uh, yeah, there's some stuff going on here. I really should make it into the dry stuff because this way I can, um, you yeah, look at that. So you can do like a thousand of this at this point. Look at that, 25. Wow, okay. Uh, I was going to say 500 for now. Even then, I don't want to spend that much. Holy crap. There you go. <laughs> Because then we can make those into papers over time, right? So at least that's giving it something to do. Uh, but anyways, yeah, fishing and fish uh, itself for cooking and stuff, not an issue, obviously. Okay, so uh, let's look at this machinist stuff. So uh, if we go into, doo -doo 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 -doo, I guess it would be this one, mechanic. I keep saying machinist. Uh, but anyways, so we learned this. There we go. Ta-da! We are now a mechanic. And we can actually unlock it through this over here. So if we go over here and we do, uh, oh yeah, we'll just take this now. Yank. Because this needed the, uh, oh, actually no, it needed space. This did not need a higher tier room, did it? It just needed space and this was before we even had the bigger room. So I might as well throw it in here for now. If we throw it in here, holy crap, you're not that big, are you? Apparently you are pretty big. Yeah, look how big this thing is. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> Anyways, might as well keep it in the same room, right? So if we uh, open this up, we should be able to make the next one we want. Do, 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 do. Carpentry Advance. It's right in front of us, I'm pretty sure. Oh, Machinist Table. See, this is where Machinist does exist. So here's the Machinist Table. So we'll go yes, and a machinist table I assume would require, look at that, a 1.7 tier, tier 2 average of room. So this room is definitely tier 2, as you can see. Um, now some of those upgrades that we didn't bother with before, I think I'm going to do them. I'm going to take my chance and just say, you know what, I'm going to always get, this will put them to the 2, right? But you get 5% less resources, or this drops the requirement. I'm going to always just assume I'm going to be good at this. And I'm going to be able to make it uh, to that. If not, whatever. I guess, well, it just basically means I have to. So, like, for example, if I want a table that requires level 3, I'm not going to get away with it and be like 2 point something, right? I'm going to have to make it a full level 3 room. That's all. And you know what? I don't mind that because I can do that. I will, I will do that and I can do that. So, it just takes some effort and time. Um, there you go. Lavish uh, work engineer. Yeah, let's do it. So 5% less resources can be a really big deal for certain things, especially later on. So why not? There you go. And I keep going through them, but not through the uh, the other parts of it, oddly enough. So there you go. Do, 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 do. Here you go. Milling. There you go. I don't have fertilizer yet. I have the skill, but there you go. Butchery. There you go. 
And then masonry did this one has one. There you go. They're all the same. It's not fancy, unfortunately. They're going to do some changes big time over the next year with this stuff, but uh, we have to wait and see what that brings. But there you go. That, that kind of fixes that all up, which I'm happy. So you are creating that. You're at 20 minute. Fine. That's good to me. I'm going to go ahead and uh, work on more of this stuff out here. This is kind of how I do these episodes in Eco, and hopefully they're not too, too overly boring or too many cut-ish type feelings because literally uh, a lot of Eco takes time. We have regular resource and time, so it takes time, but I don't mind that. It doesn't bother me. Okay, it's crazy the amount of clay I've taken out of here, and it keeps going. All this space you see here, that was all clay, so... I thought clay was more like, I think it's always in the jungle, but obviously in the main world, it's not something that's overly rare, apparently. So, um, okay, let's see if we got this made. Here we go. So we're going to do storage and grab you. There we go. And maybe we'll just put right here. There you go. So this, ta-da-da, is power tools. Oh, no, never mind. It's got a foot pedal on it. <laughs> that's cool. An assembly line, huh? Holy crap. Consumes mechanical power. That's a lot, dude. 1250. I don't have 1250 watts. Camera film. What the frig? That's all new to me. A lot of this is new to me, to be fair. I don't think we had laboratories before. Wow. So let's see. I would like... The first thing I would like to make is a steam truck, which I'm guessing you can't make one right in here. I'm guessing that's what the assembly line's for. I was hoping it'd be earlier than that, but uh, I'm guessing not. Look at all the stuff in here. Steam tractor, steam. Yeah, so <laughs> we're not even close to getting this done. Um, so I guess we need to work on this. Okay, so I know we're going to need the laboratory. You're going to need glass. Here's a lot of things we're going to need, so... A portable steam engine is probably what we make. An engine that generates power through steam. Interesting. I wonder if we place that one down. We got screw press. Okay, smoothing and woodworking that assists with creating wheels for transportation. Well, we could do one of those. Let's do that. There you go. 250 watts of power. I guess we're going to have to figure out this stuff. Um, steam engine. Here we go. A big steam engine. Ah, there we go. Consume 30 watts of mechanical power of fuel. Ah, okay, here we go. So, a steam engine takes a bunch of iron pipes. Now, do I need a room type for this or no? I don't think so. So, you can probably put this outside. So, we're going to have to come up with, uh, 12. Okay, what's going on? Okay. Let's see here. What were we doing? Uh, do, 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 over here. There you go. Anvil, yeah. Okay. So let's make some of these pipes. There you go. So 12 of them. Perfect. This is some good stuff. Yeah, I noticed some things like shaper, shaper, screw press. So we made the one thing here, right? The screw one, I think it was. Yeah, so I guess we just place it on the ground somewhere nearby and it just is a module for it, maybe? I don't, I'm not sure. Let's we'll see. Oh, it's doing that's a little lag. Well, let me click on anything till for a second. This is something to do with, yeah, there you go. Once it goes, it's good. Yeah, all of a sudden it's gone. So shaper. What about that shaper? That looks like we need that too over time. Shaper, shaper, shaper. There we go. Iron plate. Honestly, I've never made an iron plate yet. You'd think that was made in the shaper. Iron plate. Iron plate recipe. In what though? Screw press. Craft that the screw press. Oh, does the screw press have its own little uh, power grid? Okay, so you have to make the power grid. Oh, yeah, there's the iron plate. Okay. That makes sense. So, this is okay. 
Um, now, if I make this guy, I feel like, yeah, we can make the steam engine. We're just literally short the iron pipes. Okay, so that's cool. I wasn't sure about that. So this should work, I guess. Yeah, okay. And then this will take whatever time. How come I don't, I guess you have to, oh, 10 minutes right there. I'm like, usually you see a thing. So we'll start on that because those pipes are being worked on right now. Yeah, 50 s seconds till they're done. That's going to take another 10 minutes. So we'll let it do its thing and then we'll come back and see how this goes together. Now let's see what we're up to. Getting distracted in real life a bit here, but um, what are they saying? I don't think he's buying, selling what he has. Well, fishing net on the boat is way faster. But it's like the least needed thing. Okay, we're talking about fishes. He has a fishing boat. Um, let's see here. So we we're making that engine, eh? Not the portable one, even though that'd be cool. I guess that goes into a vehicle or something. <gasps> Oh yeah, we made it already. I was like, where did it go? There it is. There we have it. Look at this thing. It's an actual big ass engine. That's kind of cool. Does it require water? Oh no, it has a pipe. It probably actually requires water to run this thing, by the way. <laughs> that is so freaking cool. Let's see here. I guess over on this side, potentially, though this stuff might be in the way now. Yeah, right here might be okay. Um, There you go. Wait, wait. No room for... No, I'm not... What? Isn't this supposed to... I think I used the wrong button, maybe? I don't know. I'm not sure anymore. Okay, so to, oh, control move. There you go, we're gonna put this here, and then we'll just put this over here. Is this not my property? I think it's still my property, yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, it is, okay. Okay. So we can put this guy here, I guess. So it looks like we're going to need to get water put into this eventually, I'm guessing. Crap, that's not the right way. <laughs> we literally did it the wrong way. Come on, come on. Oh, what the heck? Oh, if you use middle mouse button, you can... I didn't realize that. Huh. Okay, there you go. Trying to find the thing. It's right there, I guess. I think this is the right way. There you go. Go off. Freaking beanie. <laughs> what a shirt. Uh, anyways. Okay, I think we did this. So you need water. Input pipe disconnected out of fuel. So I need to get more fuel, which that's easy. And I need more iron, which means I need to actually get some iron smelted, I think. I might have some iron gravel on this side, to be fair. But even then, we're not going to... We're going to need more, obviously. So... Let's see here. Um, so this is a storage anyway. So let's do the second storage. Just because it's easier to click from here to the other one anyways. So look for anything iron related, I guess. We can do this, right? We've learned we can pretty much, yeah. So look at this iron. Well, that's actually the industrial one. There you go. Yeah, so we got to get that going. And then I should mine some more, so. Whoop. But I think we might have actually... Oh, crushed iron is good in here. I guess it's just over here. These guys are done. Ah, uh, yeah, here we go. So we're done with these ones here. So 100 of these. 5,000. That's not too bad. Okay. I'm just a little low on food, so I'm going to have to get more here. Perfect. 
Okay. And then, uh, yeah, so I'll mine some more iron, get this going, and then we'll come back and we should have some more iron to work with. I'll make some pipes ahead of time as well. Not a ton, but it's not terrible either. We're getting some out of it, so that's pretty cool. We can definitely get started. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. I was like, <laughs> I was like yeah, I swear we got more than 50. <laughs> But it took a little bit of effort, to be fair, to get that. So I can't wait till you get better machines for mining. I was getting a lot of performance issues over here, but I think I helped clean it up. I think I just had too many, uh, like, little rocks sprawled around. I bet you above this. I don't even want to look, to be honest. I bet you above this it's not going to be as clean as I think it. Oh, yeah, no. Oh, yeah, this is... I didn't think of checking up here for cleaning yeah, some stuff, yeah. So you kind of have to go around cleaning up once in a while because, you know, things do break in here. I'm actually a little shocked by this. This is not me. I don't think somebody else did this, I think. Yeah, oh yeah. Somebody else definitely did this because it's got the bigger ones here. I wasn't doing ore. Uh, I don't think I did any iron ore before that. must have been this person. Till they Then they dug a hole in their house. This is funny. They. Yeah, here it is. This goes to my mind, but... <laughs> Yeah, so I'm cleaning up anyways, and hopefully that'll help over time. But, uh, yeah, you can do the math if you want. I mean, we had no slag in here pretty much, right? So, But let's put this into our slag pile, which I got to bury eventually here because it's not good to keep this above ground over time. It's not going to be the end of the world, but eventually it contributes to lots of pollution. So, But let's see what we have, my friends. Look at the stars. We have six. I'm not even really too worried about my food right now. So look at all the long terms. It's no longer a member of long term, even though I'm pretty sure I've seen some of those players on recently. Um, okay, so let's go back here. So we needed to make pipes, I think. Oh, yes. Yeah, so we were going to make a bunch of pipes for the generator. See if that works. And then uh, we'll go from there. So let's see here. Pipes, pipes, pipes. Yeah, here we go. So I don't know. Let's do... I mean, it looks like we'll use pipes over time. So let's just do 30. I mean, that's a lot, but... That way we have them done and ready. And then go from there. Okay, let's see what we can do with these pipes here. Let's run over here. Probably use this for storage. Get some um, pipes going here. Ten so far. Slow little buggers, but... I'm hoping it's just simple as doing it like this, really. I don't know. I've never done it. I don't think I've ever done it. Oh. oh, yeah, there you go. I guess it has to go in the water, but I know that might make some issues with it, so I'm just curious. Uh, oh, status, there you go. Yeah, okay, I think we have to go in the water, but it's going to make a mess, I'm sure. So is that you? Oh, no, maybe it doesn't actually screw up. Water input pipe disconnected? I think it's not. Yeah, here you go. It has an intake. It's not on. I mean, we could do one more like this, just in case. Because, you know, like maybe it needs to be open in the water block. Yeah, so it's still showing that. So I'm hoping it's just a fuel issue at this point, which we'll fix up here. This is, uh, yeah, shale. Apparently, we're not going to get it from here. <laughs> Thought we could, but apparently not. So we have to go all the way over here. Put it in the other one. Do we have any fuel in here? Oh yeah, this is all crushed coal. Okay. Let's put it in here. Might as well put the shale button in here for now. So I'm guessing the status is the same. I just make sure it doesn't update or whatever. So we're hoping that once we put the fuel in here, it just magically works at this point. Water input is disco. I'm not sure. I thought that would be enough. And it shows it is in intake here, right? Like, yeah, it shows intake here. 
it's just iron pipe. I'm kind of curious to see if it was something else. I'll look elsewhere. Input pipe disconnected. Aha, uh -huh, I'm a noob. There is an actual uh, thing for this. So let's just put this down here for fun. There you go. There's an actual water pump I have to make. That makes way more sense. I just saw it. And it does make sense for what I was doing there that, you know, it would create a suction for the water. But uh, it's a completely different process, obviously, here. So that is completely fine. Uh, you're just turned off. Oh, because you were using all the other materials for the... Oh, <laughs> aren't you a sneaky one? Do I have any shale in here right now, or did I move it? It was all in the second one, right? Yeah, okay. So we can, I think, turn you on. That's fine. Anyways, uh, mechanical pump right here. Perfect. Let's get that going here. Boo. Boo. So I'm not sure. Let's do storage here. There it is. So I wonder if this just goes in water then. It sounds like almost it does, but oh, here you go. Oh, maybe not. It looks like it might actually do something like. You know, you do it from up here kind of thing, and then, yeah, so maybe what we will do here. No room. Oh, well, yeah, we have this issue, right? Maybe we can do this, and then put this guy right here, maybe? Oh, there we go. And it's using that kind of power, so we don't have to worry about it. That is freaking cool. I like that. Okay, so... Um, let's actually change this up a wee bit here. So let's take this out, this out. That should be good. I just want to bring it a little more over here if I can. Apparently that, oh, because it's, we can always change that up too. Put this down for now. Dirt place. <laughs> there you go. No dirt place. There you go. And then put this guy right here. Yeah, that would work. Yeah, there you go. Nice. Get some water in here. Cool. And then uh, see what I mean about the freeze when I place this. This is not a server thing. This is a mod that I'm using, which only Togi and I are using it right now, which basically means anything I place gets put, his name and stuff gets placed on it. I think it glitches up a bit. So. Hmm. I want to say not bad for soloing, but um, we know he doesn't solo, so. There you go. Give that a second here, and then uh, perfect. So out of fuel, which we can fix. I guess it's did it run out of something, or is it just not running? To save resources, awesome. So it says here, global sources sinks updated every 10 minutes and zero seconds. So, so total CO2 is negative 454 per day. 325 ppm total already at minimal level from pollution, 20 per day. Uh, something lifetime from animals, 25. Global lifetime from plants, negative 500 per day, blah, blah, blah. Okay. For everything past 340, I guess. Interesting. Okay, cool. So that, that should be good, though. I think we've done our part here. So we can just throw you over here for now. Perfect. So we got our first steam generator up. One step towards a steam truck, right? So this stuff, I guess, should work now. So we were looking at iron plates. So what, what did we actually want to make? I think we were going to make the second uh, device here. Basically the print press. Yeah, so look at all the things we have to make. Wow, that is some cool stuff. And there's a screening one here, too, I guess we'll want to make. Oh, and the shaper. 
Wow, there's a whole bunch of stuff to make here. Okay, I'm going to take a picture of those just to get an idea of what I want to make here. Do it on this side. There you go. Okay. And uh, let's see here. So, oh, I move things around, so I'm being a pain. Okay, so I can make plates and pistons. So the one thing takes, oh, two, yeah, well, they take gear, so... Pistons. How many pistons do I need? 16. I guess these are all advanced, I guess. Yeah. But let's do 16. Wow, that's a lot. Oh, my goodness. Those iron. Holy crap. You want 16 pistons for the shaper? Yeah. Oh, boy. So we need more of these, guys. This is fine. I'll get more going. It just takes more time, right? So you need 16 pistons for the shaper. And then we're going to need 16 plates for it. Plus, we're going to need a lot of them anyways for other things. But, yeah, so you, you can get the idea. This is going to take some some resources. Perfect. And eventually, we'll probably double out on these, right? So, well, that's cool. So, there you go. She's running, and I guess this is out here. Awesome. Very cool. I like that. Okay. And then we just the waiting game, right? So, we continue on. Okay, so we should be able to make the shaper now. Yeah, how long is this going to take? I didn't pay attention there. Five minutes, that's not so bad. Cool, we have the screw press. Okay, the shaper is next. Iron gears, do you think that's probably what? Shaper, I'm guessing? Shaper. Okay, we're going to need more plates. We're going to need some more pistons as well, at least, here in the future, so... Um, let's see here. Let's get some more pistons going. And more iron plates always. Look at that. We're getting so many of the other stuff now. This is awesome. Awesome. Probably like this. Cool. So, there she is. I want to see it this way, I think. That looks cool. I love, I love the noise and animation on this. I guess, like, squeaky as hell. Oh, so this is the gearboxes, the iron gears, which I'm pretty sure I need some iron gears wired away anyway. So let's, let's, let's do 100 of them? No. Um, actually, it's not so long to do that. Look at that. Look at how little fast that is. That's awesome. Get some iron gears going here. Awesome. And then we'll need some gearboxes too. Basically this gears and then screws. Who's doing the screws by the way? Who is doing those screws? I think the lathe. That's what it was. And the lathe we're not quite there yet. Oddly enough you need iron wheels and iron plates. We could do iron wheels. Oh wait, we can do iron wheels. Yeah. Have I made? I think I had to. Yeah, I think we have made iron wheels. Cool. Okay, let's get those guys going. And uh, does that mean it's working? I can't tell right now. Wait, what is it? Missing. I'm so confused. Oh, it's deactivated right now. It was like, I swear I'm doing it right. <laughs> Um, also over here, because of all the crap we've been getting over here, we could probably move some of this over now. <laughs> oh boy, that's a lot. We can get some of these roads made if we have any more, uh... Oh, we're out of mortar anyways. So that's fine. We could probably make more of that too, to be fair, if we got sand. I think we do. Oh, wrong table. I think we have more sand than that, to be honest, but it might be on the other side. Oh, uh, main stock. There's some sand there. Okay, let's check on this side. Do we have any sand? No. Wow, okay. Apparently sand is not something we really have of. Huh. Well, I'll make what we have in sand. Might as well. And then uh, I can always get more later just so we can finish up what we got here. So... Well, I guess that was too many. There you go. At least I'll get some of those roads going. And then I've been working on slowly expanding the roads up here, by the way. So I might as well show you that. I've been working due diligently here. 
So I got this up. I'm going to go up partway. I'm not going to go all the way through the whole thing. Not right now. Eventually, probably. But I'm just doing it up to probably over here. And then this guy will be like, what the? <laughs> that style. Um, but yeah, I almost got it done. So I'm just working on this. I just realized it hit level uh, 5 machinists here. So that's kind of cool. Um, so we've been doing parallel. I mean, for this stuff, it gets expensive. But I'm going to still do the parallel. That just seems the right way, but yeah, we keep on locking new things like stove recipe. Look at this. Crane recipe, blast furnace recipe. There's some cool stuff coming up. What is this? Mechanics modern upgrade recipe. Very cool. Nice. Right, so this is going really well. Let's see what we can do now. So, um, lathe was one that looked like it was pretty important on the list, to be fair. We'll start that. You can do the medium shipyard. Uh, I guess eventually, yeah, I would want that. Uh, not right now, but uh, I'll like to make some ships, right? So I think that'll be kind of cool. A small paper machine. Oh, this is kind of cool. There's some really cool stuff here. I like this, the steel boy. This is steel, though. We haven't done steel yet. We'll probably get there soon, though. Hey, so we got this lathe gun done now. Oh, whoa, nice looking. Okay. And I can always use, like, you know, I can go like this. So, um, like something like this, maybe. It's up to you, but, you know, use something like more of the middle of the floor. Get a little bit more room out of the base anyways, right? Um... Anyways, yeah. So, iron axles. Ooh, we're getting so freaking close to it. It's just that machinist table or whatever we need. That's going to be the hardest part. Assembly line, sorry. I say that, but we're getting there. Portable steam engine. I think we could do it. We just got to keep working on it. The boiler. Oh, my goodness. The boiler is like punch me in the... <laughs> Woo. I think that might be another episode, to be fair, because I need to farm some more copper and stuff, but we're getting there. We're getting freaking close. Um, okay, so anyways, let's see. We got their lathe anyway, so this is those screws and axles. So this is cool. We wanted this anyway, so uh, let's get some of these started here. Perfect. And then what else are we going to do after this guy? So... Um, I was looking at these guys here. I wanted to see what this one was about, the stamp mill. I think this might be something we want, to be fair. Yeah, it has crush rock level 2 recipes in here. I think you can actually do sand here. So there's a recipe for sand. And I don't know much about it, but I think this is what it is. So let's see... Rock Crusher. Yeah, you do sand concentrate there too, to be fair. But I think you do it better in this stuff for some odd reason. Screen Machine. A sensor-based belt sorter. That sounds so cool. Rock... Okay, so Screen Machine for this. Okay. And it requires silica. And then silica is used in the sand concentrate level 2 recipe. Which then I'm assuming... Oh, sorry. Yeah, crush stuff. Sandstone, for example. And then you can make that in the stamp mill, which I think is what you want over time if you want to do this easier. Plus, I could do the roads. I would say the one's better for roads anyways to get started. Um, and then that way we got that. So I'll do that. And then, as you saw, I need more wood. So I'll get those done over here. So, yeah, let's get a couple of these done here. Oh, we could do like 250, I guess. Use 300 on both. There you go. And there you go. Perfect. And that'll get us going. My food's so imbalanced right now. It's all right. Oh, look what we have here. Stamp mill. Look at this guy. Oh, look at this thing. It's fancy. Cool. Maybe we'll put it over here for fun. It doesn't really matter, but uh, yeah, let's put it here. There you go. Look at this thing. That is so cool. <laughs> I love the looks of it. Look at those teeth. 
Okay, so this is like the new age crush version. Now, I wonder if there's a better recipe on this. Look at this. There's four to one on here. I'm interested in this. Let's see. Crushed iron. So let's see. In this one, two and one, 12. Oh, I see. So it is more efficient. Yeah, because look at you put uh, 12 iron in and you get two out of that. You put 20 in, you get four out of that. And then I guess this one's even better. You put 20 in here and you get five out of there and no byproducts. Interesting. Oh, yeah. So for now on, I need to use this. This is not a maybe I'll use it. It is a must use. That is so freaking cool. So the only downside is this ain't going to reach. But I don't think this has to be indoors. So win? Yeah, this does not have to be indoors. So that's a win there. What do they say? Let's see. So I want this over here. So this is going to take power power now, which is interesting. Um, I would just put it over here to be fair. It doesn't really matter too much. Um, maybe we'll put it over here for now. As long as it can reach this pile, which that's all it's going to do, right? So this, so this replaces all of these basically. Holy crap. <laughs> I didn't look at the speed of this which i need to figure that out so yeah this is this but large uh big unit so let's look at this thing here so let's see here so this does the four so let's see here so this takes two minutes this takes one minute so it doubles it in one minute so basically this is four of these and i have eight of these so i run two of these and I just beat all this. I can't believe it, but these are garbage now to us. That's actually some really good news. Unfortunately, you have to cancel all these to... Yeah, I don't know if there's a way to mass cancel them or anything. I don't think so. I think we've had this conversation before. I don't know if you can go like... Oh, I can do enter though. Okay. So that works better here. So I can do right click, right click, right click, and I'm just hitting enter each time. So there you go. That's actually not so bad. I don't know who did that, but thank you. There you go. Now, to be fair, am I being stupid? Because is there things I might need? Oh, I didn't think of that till now. Oh no, this has that and more. Oh, you can. Oh, is this from Rhodes? Yeah, so you can do slag as well with this. Crush slag. Which has a crush rock tag, rock tag on it. Awesome. Yeah, okay. We're good. Go. Oh, yeah, we're not enough room now. So let's put this. Um put it in here. I'll probably throw this in the store after. Just in case anyone wants it. Oh, I'm not doing shift. I'm doing control. There you go. Perfect. Okay. All that calories. It's like, can I get those calories back? Oops. Crap. There you go. Very nice. Okay. I can't believe we just did all that and replaced it with this guy. And then we could just move this guy, honestly, over here. And there you have it. Awesome. Okay, so um, the first thing I would like to do is I'm going to put the other stuff. So we're going to do this like always. We're going to do this, this, and this, and this. And we're going to do industrial stockpile here. Just in case I want to see this. I want these close because I want to be able to open them if I need to for trading back and forth. And there you go. So... Uh, yeah, so I like to have these so I can just drop my slag in here, right? But basically we just use this one and then that's it. And then, uh, yeah, so I have these guys. This is a slag. I'm pretty sure I have slag over here. So 
I want to double check because I want to move that over now. I think I have slag here, but let's see. Slag. Yes, we do. Okay, so um, st stockpile one. So that's this guy here. We'll just go here. And what we're going to do is transfer this over to the second one anyways. That'll be nice and close. There we go. So this will be all the slag. And this is just awesome because I can finally convert that slag into crushed material and then use it one step closer to the road stuff, which is awesome. And then, yeah, so, uh, oh, yeah, storage. We can just type slag like this, which should show this one too. There we go. And perfect. We can get rid of that. And then, yeah, we can do this one. Let's look at the slag, crush slag. Awesome. So everything should be better. Even crushed shale recipe. Like we've done crushed shale before, obviously. So in this one, crushed shale. Oh, you can do oh advanced masonry table. Interesting. Oh, that's that recipe. But crushed shale, for example, 12 for output is 3. 12 for 3, but the new one is uh, 20 for 5. So definitely better. This is so cool. Okay, I love seeing progression like this, like feeling like, you know, you have that progression going that rewards you in that way. Now, obviously, modules, good luck. <laughs> Mining, advance, yeah. We're going to have to look into those eventually, but that's not happening today for sure. But there you go, 38 minutes to get those done. I'm just going to get enough to get those done because I want to obviously uh, save these up. And then, um, yeah, you got the Crush Cool Genesis. Yeah, because I don't even think you can do Genesis with the other one, for example. So that gives you an idea, but yeah. Very cool. And then we should probably do our, other, you know, normal stuff. So iron and everything else. So let's see. Let's do uh, iron. How much are we looking at? 100 iron? Okay, let's do 100. 100 iron. And then um, 100 copper. There you go. And uh, 100 crushed coal, I guess. There's a lot of freaking coal eventually. Oops. There you go. And yeah, that should be good for that. That's awesome. Now, I want the other thing because it's one of these guys, right? So you have these recipes, the concentrates. I honestly would rather get the next concentrate going here. So that's the screaming machine. I think we should do that for this episode as well because that's a huge upgrade to everything. And then I'll probably make two of everything eventually, right, to speed it up. But even then, I'm kind of slow. It's not like I need to speed it up. Sometimes I do a lot of mining at once, right? But I can see myself not going too crazy here. Oh, my goodness. I need freaking lights. I know you can do lights, but I think we need glass still for lights. So, like... I know there was light somewhere, but I think we're still like, I think we're too lobby for light still. Yeah, you got all this other stuff, right? Like the tallow ones and stuff like that. But yeah, I might check those out off camera for fun. I don't want to sit here crafting lights right now, but it's dark in here. You just have to live with it. <laughs> Usually what I do for you guys is I crank this up. There you go. Not so... No, with this brick color, it doesn't really help, does it? Okay, so we want... The last thing that we want is the screening machine, right? Yeah. Concentrate. Yeah, okay. So we're going to do this one now because we can afford it already. Awesome. Okay, here we go. Screen machine, very awesome. Okay, oops. This is cool. So we got the upgraded screen machine. Screen, screen machine. I keep, I say it right, I think, but I keep wanting to say scream machine in my head. Obviously, this does not require a room, thankfully. Uh, not that we don't have the room for it, but imagine having to have a room for this. This would be just evil. I love it. They should do it now. But I'm an evil person. So I'm going to put this puppy right here for now. Look at this thing. <laughs> I'd say that thing knows how to screen a bit. 
That is awesome. So let's turn... Actually, was it all off? It almost looked like it was, but I don't think it was. There you go. There you go. There you have it. Is that... Well, you guys can't hear it. My mic's not picking it up. The uh, filter is good enough on it. But uh, anyways, ooh, tailings. Oh, it's a different tailings? Anyway, so yeah, it's a different tailing. It's less. Aww. Concentrate dry iron tailings. Oh, wait, is it? Yeah. Oh, no, it's still tailings. Are these just. I think these are wet tailings, to be fair. Is there a way to transfer tailings to wet tailings? I don't like the fact that I'm not killing the world as fast. <laughs> I'm an ass. Okay, so this is awesome because we run what, like one of these things or two of these things, anyways, which has been pretty good to be fair. So let's see what the numbers are like on this thing. So, um, let's see. So we have this recipe here. So, yeah, this is what is this? Uh, ingredients. So, five crushed iron gives you two, one concentrate to give you an idea. And that's 1.5. So 5, 1, 1. 1.5. And then this is 3, 1. So look at that. We went from 5 to 3. That's a huge difference. And uh, it's uh, 1. Uh, 112. Oh, this might be a different because I'm not looking at it with our bonus probably. But uh, 1, 7. So this is actually technically faster. But you get more out of this. So you can't really complain about that. Yeah, so... Four to two, and this is three to one. Or wait, what? Oh no, I was looking at the wrong way. Four to one, and look at this one. This is three to one. Wow. Okay, so that is nicer. These do have modules, I think, though, right? Yeah, and they might have been helping, which I didn't even remember to upgrade them. But man, I'm not gonna worry about it now because I want the new machine. So. Uh, in the end, this will work really well. So let's go ahead and uh, you get the concentrate for the sand stuff there too. Now this only does the one type, so this won't do the others, not yet. So we should probably cancel. I actually left the other one in there. So I should leave these in here for now. And uh, yeah, stop canceling the copper one. There you go. Let's add copper back into here. There you go. Perfect, because so you want these for copper, right? But we'll leave them for the other stuff here. And then this one will be our new iron one, obviously. There you go. So um, what's that look like? Well, that's a lot of... Yeah, I gotta go fill that up. <laughs> now we gotta go slow, because I ate all my food there. Ugh. Okay, let's go here, storage. And uh, I think it's a shift click. Yeah, here you go. Just go like this. There you go. Eee. And apparently I don't like this, but it's balancing my food right now, so I'll suck it. There you go. Boom. Perfect. Oh, I got the... I don't think I'm disconnected. We'll see. There it goes. I don't know what causes that. I think it's a client issue with the server. I'm not sure, but... But there we have it. So this is really good for us. So we have the new tailings anyways. And thank you. But uh, yeah, that's good. He put a spreadsheet there. So I'll check that out. So I'm really happy with this. This really, really got a lot of stuff done. Um, I think that's pretty much it for today. What I'll do on off camera is I might make some pistons, some iron plates... Even copper plates, maybe some axles, screws, things like that. Just for the future here, right? Just to get a little ready. But, uh, yeah, so we have... Oh, yeah, we've... Uh, sorry. 
I was like, I thought we had a little bit more, you know, gearboxes and things like that. But uh, yeah, overall, I think this episode was amazing. We got lots done. I'm really excited. I need to mine some copper for sure for our vehicle for a night later on in life. But uh, either way, I'm really happy. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.